I needed some backup. So I started with Nana, John Henry Clark. Okay? Let me turn the light on for y'all. Let's talk about this elephant in the room. Okay? Let's talk about this elephant. I can't even see myself, so I don't know if I'm even recording right. I want to talk about these elephants in the room. Let's just start out. Let's get this out of the way right now. I hate you, <laughs> and you're going to hate me. I'd rather you hate me than love me how y'all loving some niggas who don't deserve no love. Well, maybe they do deserve love because love is a European word anyway. Anyway, I medo my people. Hmm. Most of y'all don't know what Mado mean, but one day you'll find out, because this is not about that. Uh, let's talk about these elephants in the room. Let me get you going to hate me. Okay, first of all, I didn't want to talk about R. Kelly because he's insignificant to me. Okay? Yeah, I used to listen to the dude's songs when I was young and immature. We're going to sit here and let the media turn you against your brother. They've been trying to do this for years to come. They've been planting this seed. Everybody know R. Kelly like young girls. Okay? Before these girls' parents let them even go want where a man is. And when they say R. Kelly, they let it be. Because what? He got fame and money. We promoted stuff like that. Okay? None of the girls ain't that that young. Overstand. I'm not saying it's right. What I'm saying is be careful how people plant a seed. And then later on when something happened to the brother. Y'all on the rest in peace, R. Kelly. Oh, they, it was a conspiracy. This is the same shit they did to Michael Jackson. Knowing Michael Jackson ain't molest nobody. I don't care who you are or what you say you think you know. That man ain't molest not one child. But when you sell out, as Michael, Michael, Michael Jackson did, he sold out. That's why he ended up bleaching his skin, changing his nose. He hated who he was. And when they divided him from self completely, then they turned us against him. Same thing with Prince. But Prince was smart enough to foresee it before it got right up on it. That's why he changed his name to a symbol. Prince changed his skin color, changed his nose too. Planted his seed in a place where it shouldn't have been planted. Michael too. When they divide you from self, that wicked entity. That's when they turn your, your brothers and sisters against you. Now let's talk about the elephant in the room. We shouldn't be mad with R. Kelly about nothing they say. What I'm mad with R. Kelly is, this is how a grown ass man deal with a situation. Jumping up, crying. 
acting like a damn fool. You one of the most talentedest persons in the world when it comes to entertaining and r and being and singing and writing music. And hardly nobody can touch R. Kelly with it. All who could is dead and gone. Huh? That man got more talent in his little finger than half of them in, in the R&B industry right now. And he wasted it. What we should be upset with is, is this how a grown man handle his business? R. Kelly is older than me. And I'm in my late 30s. All of the money and the wealth and the fame, he ain't gained no wisdom as a man. You can tell it by the woman he chooses. He chooses young women because he has nothing to offer a real woman. He couldn't deal with a woman like me. Because I don't put up with foolishness. And you have to man up. Now, with that being said, let's get on Will Smith. Yeah, Will Smith is promoting a bucket tour. Bucket, a tour like a bucket list. The things he do, he's having a Facebook page. They want you to follow him. You know, they got that black face. But remember, Negro been in Hollywood a long time. Hello. Jada Smith. She got her new talk show. So now why all I see on Facebook, nobody's talking about Will Smith, them uh, providing clean water for this amount of people. When you want publicity, the first thing they do in Hellawood, okay, is to make you donate a charity. Huh? They clean up one little small spot so you don't see the piles of piles of shit that they not piled up over there. We say, ooh, look how he cleaned that one spot right there. What about the tons of tons of shit that's right next door? Hello? Because if you accept one thing, you're going to accept the other. Huh? That's why all the men dressing like women now. Clothing don't have a gender. His child. Him and his wife don't even have a regular relationship. Dividing y'all niggas from yourself. 